Hey beautiful souls, welcome back to Linofuro, where mindfulness meets magic. I'm thrilled to have you here as we embark on a journey of self-discovery and manifestation. I infuse my everyday routines with purpose and mindfulness, starting with simple acts of self-care, from setting intentions while washing my face, to clearing mental clutter as I brush my teeth and manifesting health while scrubbing my tongue, every action becomes a moment of mindfulness and intentionality. Together, let's transform our daily rituals into powerful tools for holistic well-being. Hey, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for staying and keep watching my videos. It's truly encouraging me to create more videos for you guys and for myself to see in the future. Today, I will we'll be going to Otaki and to go for the one-day retreat with Bhakti Lounge. Um, and then after that, I'll be working, training. Yes, I started working this week, so stay tuned. Forget just days off. Weekends are all about connection, growth, and finding your tribe. Every Saturday, I make it a point to clear my schedule and explore the incredible city of Wellington with my family. It's a chance to really connect and create lasting memories. We are in Otaki here to help out with the photo shoot and video shoot as well. I'm volunteering in editing photos and videos in at Bhakti Lounge and helping out to promote their social media. This little escape was just what I needed to recenter, rejuvenate my body, mind, and soul. Feeling refreshed and ready to tackle the week ahead. Isn't it incredible what even a short trip can do? So remember, weekends are all your oyster. Make the most of them, explore, connect, and prioritize your well-being. You deserve it. Feeling how New Zealand nature push feels like. It's so different from the city. I'm so grateful to be here. Yeah, I couldn't stay for quite a long time, unfortunately, because I have training at the evening time. So I'm going to be here until afternoon and we'll leave back to the city. I'm so grateful for my friend from Bhakti Lounge. She didn't know that I planned to come things just happen again in roles <laughs> she offered me to use her car when she is off to her family in Rotorua and I was like mm, I'm not sure because I I don't really know where to go on the weekend and then I thought hey I think I can come to Otaki um, and here I am <laughs> I'm so blessed in this community and I feel that this community helps me to find my true self and non-judgmental, filled with gratitude, kindness, purity and I feel like this is my home. <laughs> Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Standing here bathed in the dappled sunlight filtering through the ancient trees, I feel a deep sense of peace. Each mindful step connects me further to the earth, grounding me in her ancient energy. The gentle touch of each bark whispers stories of resilience and growth, a constant reminder of nature's endless bounty. 
the air creeps and clean, carries the sweet songs of unseen birds and the rustling symphony of leaves, a calming lullaby that soothes the soul and elevates the spirit. This mindful immersion in the forest is like a homecoming, a reconnection to my true self and the rhythm of the universe that pulses within all living things. Remember from the last video when I get to do the chores, weeding, and here we are, so clean, harvested quite a bit of it, they grow well without the weeds, so I'm really glad. There is something incredibly grounding about being out in nature, especially during harvest time. Look at these beautiful ripe apples. I couldn't resist picking some for everyone. It feels like such a gift to be able to harvest from the earth's bounty. There is a real sense of abundance and connection that washes over me when I'm surrounded by such generosity from nature. It's a feeling I want to share with everyone here at the retreat. <laughs> Not to share with the Lama. I didn't know this Lama existed out just outside the retreat. So, probably next time Lama? Okay? Yeah? Okay. And that's a wrap for this week's journey into mindful living with Lynn at Linofuro. Remember beautiful souls, these moments of mindfulness and connection are always available. They are waiting for you in your daily rituals, in the vibrant city with your loved ones, and in the tranquil embrace of Mother Earth. Thank you for joining me on this exploration. Take these mindful practices with you into your week and remember you are worthy of well-being. Until next time, be well and take care. Namaste.